morning, at least 19 people are dead, including nine children in the Bronx. This is New York City's deadliest fire in 30 years. 63 people were injured, 32 of whom went to the hospital with life-threatening conditions. Firefighters arrived within minutes, finding victims on every floor of the building. Officials say the death toll is likely to climb. Let's get to CNN's Bryn Gingras live in the Bronx with the latest on this horrible tragedy, Bryn. Yeah, I mean, just unimaginable devastation here, John, as families lost loved ones just within a matter of minutes. Now, the fire was in just one apartment bu- uh, apartment of this building, and it actually stayed in that apartment, but it was the smoke that just quickly spread throughout the entire building, suffocating people as they tried to escape. As you said, 19 people were killed, nine of them children, and dozens more are fighting for their lives this morning. This morning, the New York City Fire Department and fire marshals are investigating a deadly fire at a 19-story apartment building in the Bronx. At least 19 people lost their lives, including nine children. Dozens more were injured, including 13 people in life-threatening condition, according to Fire Commissioner Daniel Nigro. I think uh, it certainly is traumatizing when we can't save a life.